What's up guys, it's Kyle from Newell Strength located in Hillsborough, New Jersey. <clears throat> um, in case you're not familiar with our gym, we specialize, uh, I shouldn't say specialize, but we have athlete training, which was our original endeavor. And we've done very well with that. Uh, middle school athletes all the way through college uh, slash pro athletes and then adult fitness. But <clears throat> one of the things that we do no matter what, um, no matter what level, what age of the client, is we work on mindset. So I'm very happy to announce that I was accepted and invited to be in a Mind Map Mastery course. Um, there's about 50 guys from around the world that Dax Moy had asked to be in the group. Um, so that's something I'm doing to further my education with mindset and, and really true coaching, not just dictating, not relying on motivation or willpower. But some of the things that... Um, you have to be very clear on when you're trying to make a change. Um, again, no matter what uh, way you're going. So you have to have clear definitions of health. What does health mean to you? Take time to write it out. It might be things such as um, good energy, joints feel good, um, optimal sleep, uh, a happy mood, a, a sense of wellness. Everybody thinks health when they go into a gym and they, and they think six-pack abs, they think, uh, you know, beach body, th things that maybe not are, they might not even be part of your definition. So be, get clear on that because most people never get clear on that. Therefore, they don't know when they achieve optimal health. And the second thing is happiness. Again, how do you know you, you're happy if you don't know what your definition of happiness is? Too many times we let external... Um, sources such as media and what we hear out there kind of dictate what uh, happiness should mean. You know, nice car, big house, vacation home, trophy wife, the list goes on, um, the material possessions. But, you know, I know for me that that's not my definition of happiness. I've got something on the wall posted over there. Um, it, it was from when I did the passion test, the book, and there's five things on there that, you know, I know I need to do every day to be happy, like always learning, going for a walk with Devin and the dogs. Very simple things, having great mentors, and I can do them every day, and I'm happy every day. So um, I make time, you know, consistently to, to come up with my definitions, because your definitions are going to evolve and change as well. But take time tonight, tomorrow, write down your definition of happiness, write down your definition of health, and you'll have much better clarity and you'll have a sense of uh ease as you go about the process. If you have any questions, hit me up at kyle at newellstrength.com. Peace, guys.